lighting for your home and office is what we're talking about today with electrician Terry Peterman and it's a great way to add interest and drama to any room. Now an increasingly popular trend is home automation. Tell me about that. Home automation is anywhere from dimming lights to uh, whole home systems where you can integrate your, your stereo, your internet, everything into one system but really with, with lighting and we're talking about lighting Another great way to save energy is with dimmers. Okay. It's, there's been studies that have shown that the average American home has three TVs, but less than one dimmer average per household. So <laughs> dimmers are a great way to set moods, set scenes, and also for security as well. So okay. uh, these are just some examples of dimmer switches. We've got just your, your basic rotary that everybody's familiar with. That, uh, right. That's generally where you'll find the one or less than in a home is in the dining room, perhaps you'd have a, a rotary dimmer like that on your chandelier. Okay. Um, one thing to mention, they haven't really perfected the compact fluorescent dimming technology, so okay. you can't <laughs> use the compact fluorescent bulbs on your average, on your standard dimmer switch right now. Okay. But this just shows you some of the different styles. You can incorporate uh, to your old ivory toggle systems, you can right incorporate dimmer switches. So you can just uh, have a toggle switch with a slide dimmer on the side to set your level of light. So instead of this, you could have this and see this little thing on the... That's right. And then you've got a sure dimmer that you have a preset that. level. So as soon as you turn that on, it comes to that preset level and then you could adjust it. And then there's the Symphony series here, the Maestro dimmers from Lutron, where uh, they're one touch. You can have them set to a preset level and when you just tap it, it fades off. And you can have uh, remote dimmers as well, where you can have one dimmer switch controlling a light and then up to nine others that control that same light So it's from so wherever fancy. you are in the room. It's so fancy. And now I know why you're an electrician, because you like all the sparkly green lights and toggles and things like that. Yes. Okay, where, what's the best placement for dimmers and, and things like that? Can they go anywhere in the well, room or the, office? Well, the dining room's a nice spot for them. Mm -hmm. Bedroom for wall sconces. If you have wall sconces in your bedroom, you can uh, set the level of light there. Um, the whole home systems, a nice part of those is if you've got a whole home lighting system, you can uh, say you're coming home from, from grocery shopping, you raise the garage door, there mm -hmm. can be another button in your, your headliner that you push, that can set the scene to uh, light up the path from the garage to the kitchen. And then you can push another button that sets the scene for, for home entertainment. So if you're watching a movie, you can just one button, bring down all the lights that you don't want on, bring up to a certain light level, say wall sconces for some mood lighting, and, and away you go with the movie. So that's a, and plus security, a big thing in, uh, in a whole home system. Say you've gone to bed at night, did we shut all the lights off? Well, one button, all the lights are off in the house. And then you may hear something in the middle of the night, one button and they're all back on. And they also can be tied into your security system to bring all the lights on. So that's, uh, that's basically the systems that are available. There's mm -hmm. Radio Raw and Lutron, and then there's uh, all these examples we brought here. I really like it. Thanks to Westburn for that. Yes, thank you again so much. Okay, I'm going to keep on playing with these because...